So what's up, YouTube? Um, we back with another quick unboxing. Um, I just picked up this Orbi Wi-Fi 6 uh, router from Best Buy. And I'm unboxing it now. I've been looking online to see if there were any reviews and I haven't seen any. Um, so <clears throat> I'm going to do my own review. You guys can get a quick look at the packaging. Um, comes with an app. It's a normal app that I already have. And I already have the Orbi mesh uh, system. Just so you guys can take a look. We have um, one main router right here. And I have AT&T fiber. Um, so I get, you know, gigabits, uh, gigabit speeds. This is the other satellite in my kid's room. And then I have the three um, nodes. So I have another satellite in my room. Just to quickly show you guys that one, you can see it over there. So what I have set up is currently overkill for my apartment. Um, like I said, I'm in a process, you know, of talking to people, trying to get a house. So once I do move into my house, I will be set up and good to go. Um, but <clears throat> this right here, this system right here, it only comes with two nodes. Um, I might get a third, like I said, once I do get my house, but I'm not gonna, you know, go crazy and buy another third one again. Um, all right, so let's take a look at the packaging. All right, so what is this? This is some setup information. We'll get into the unboxing part. Okay, download, install, and explore. Got some more information on the back. Um, Packaging looks really nice. Everything looks tightly in place. Um, these towers are pretty big. Um, well, I guess they're about the same size. They look a little bit bigger than the last models. We're gonna do a quick comparison in terms of size. Um, so let's take this out the package. Okay. So I believe that this is the router. Um, I mean, I will be changing that, so that's not a huge deal. Showing you guys my password and everything, but you guys don't know where I live at. Um, and that will be getting changed. Okay, so this is a satellite. Uh, I think I'm going to be placing the satellite in my big room. Okay, so let's take a look at some of the details. Um, all right, so here we go. Okay, so my video cut out, my phone died. So um, instead of waiting, I just proceeded with setting everything up. And um, I'm gonna give you a little bit of details about the product. So um, what you get inside of the box, you get this RBR850 router. And then over here is where I got the RBS850 satellite. Um, I do have holders, like wall mounted holders for these uh, satellites and routers, but um, they were set up for the old Orbi system, which is a lot smaller. And while I'm over here, I'm gonna do a quick size comparison so you guys can quickly see. In fact, this is my first time seeing them together like that. Um, so um, it's a little bit bigger and wider uh, for the new Orbi system. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, back to what you get inside of the box. Um, you get the router, you get the satellite, you get some ethernet cables, and you also get your power adapters. Um, and then of course you get your, you know, your information, your quick start guides and things like that. Um, in order for you to utilize the system, you're gonna wanna have a high speed internet connection. Um, and also the the, uh, the mobile app. That's all you're gonna need. Uh, so I'm trying to remember. It's hard for me to remember off the top of my head. So this is the Orbi AX6000. Um, this is supposed to have four times the capacity of the Wi-Fi 6, or I'm sorry, the Wi-Fi 5 specifications. So this is the Wi-Fi 6. Um, so you're gonna get a lot more performance with this. Um, you're gonna get your Moo Mimo, uh, you know, which is capable for simultaneously uh, downloading data and streaming data. Um, you have a much more powerful uh, quad-core processor. I think it's at 2.2 gigahertz. 
Um, you have about 512 mega, megabytes of NAND flash memory. Um, I think each of these routers have about eight antennas inside of them, uh, if I'm not mistaken. And then, um, you know, you're going to have to look at some of the other uh, specifications. I'm not going to be able to remember all of those. I know it is uh, able to sync and link with uh, Alexa and Google Assistant. I'm having trouble connecting to the Internet. Take a look at the help section in your Alexa app. Okay, so on the back of these uh, satellites and routers, well, on the back of the router, you get four gigabit ports. Um, let's see if I can kind of... Um, you can see that I have about three hooked up. There's about, uh, there's a slot for one more port. And then, you know, I have the um, the LAN cable connected. Um, I do have at and fiber optics. So that's the fiber optic system right there, which is connected directly to the router. And, um, you know, I get, I've already tested my download speeds. I'm going to try to see if I can take a, a, a snapshot of my speeds uh, that I'm getting wirelessly. I'm getting almost 900, uh, you know, uh, uh, megabytes per second um, of wireless download speeds, which is crazy for me. You know, I, uh, with my last system, with the same internet, uh, with AT&T, but with the last Orbi system, I was only getting around, you know, 300, 400 wireless and um, getting a lot more speed with this new system. So, um, you know, I'm happy with the setup. You know, I should be able to stream, you know, up to 8K, uh, uh, sized movies. Um, I don't have any devices that really can connect to Wi-Fi 6. I still have an old MacBook over here. Um, I have a Lenovo Yoga over there as well. Um, none of those are, are are going to be able to speak to the router, but I do have the new iPhone 11, which I think is capable of the um, Wi-Fi 6 connection. And that's where I was getting those speeds at. So um, that's going to be the update. You know, this is the new tri-band uh, Orbi mesh network. And um, so far, I'm impressed with everything. Um, in fact, I just got this from Best Buy. I don't think that it's supposed to release yet. I think it's actually going to release on Netgear's site uh, at the end of October. Um, today is the, the 24th. All right, so real quick, before I get up out of here, I wanted to make a quick video doing a speed test on the new... Um, internet service so just give me one second all right so what i'm going to do is here let me see if i can get this thing to focus all right whatever we're going to go to the orbi app you can see it right here this is the only wi-fi 6 client that i have um which is this iphone 11 pro max you can see some of the download and upload speeds right there but I want to run a quick test live. So we'll just give that a second. And this is a wireless, you know, uh, download and upload transmission. So that should let you know, you know, what type of, um, you know, service you're getting with these type of routers. Um, I've seen a couple of reviews on the Best Buy website. Uh, they weren't too positive. Um, you know, I heard people talking about, you know, the satellite dropping out, um, disconnecting from the main router. Um, I haven't had any of those issues. You can see, uh, see right here that we have a ping of five milliseconds, an upload of 944 megabytes and a download of 931 megabytes. So super fast speeds. Um, I can't wait until they start to, you know, roll out laptops and desktops and other devices that utilize a Wi-Fi 6 uh, standard. Uh, but just wanted to add this video so you guys can see some real world uh, performance. In fact, let's take another speed test. I got another speed test app, which is this one right here. So we'll quickly take a look at this one. This one typically has uh, variations in terms of speeds. All right, so we got... We'll see what this one ends at. And I've gotten speeds faster than that, um, faster than that uh, using this app. Uh, but right now I got a speed of uh, 497 on download, 645 on upload. Uh, so still a solid performance. Um, hopefully that helps you guys with your buying decision. Until next time, I'm going to highlight you YouTube.